What are the first things you notice about a person? Is it race, gender, their clothes, or maybe their hairstyle? Whatever it may be, gender is one of the first things we notice about a person when we see them. Between genders, they seem so different that it should be obvious which one anyone is. But you know what they say about assumptions. Take Jack here. Looks like your typical young man. But anatomically, he and I are not so different. I was born female, and I'm transitioning to be male. Jack Kofer is a transgendered student at UK. He's an activist in Lexington's queer community. He helped bring Dr. Marcy Bowers to campus to speak about this issue. Bowers is regarded as a pioneer in the transgender surgical field and is also transgendered. She says one thing all people should recognize is this. Uh, gender roles and gender expression are put there to keep male, you know, to keep us apart, the two genders. But really, biologically, sexual dimorphism means we're really not very much different. She says having gone through a gender transition, she can help others who are struggling. Um, the feeling of not having things, you know, not having my genitalia match my brain was really, really hard. And it, and it, it was a constant angst. I found myself angry a lot, and I was, I was a much meaner person because I couldn't be who I was. Bowers says young people now are open and accepting to what she says is honesty in our sexuality. Cover says it doesn't take surgical procedures to recognize this. If the numbers don't go up, the voices come up. There are just as many trans people in Lexington right now as there were last year, or maybe 10 years ago. It's just now you're hearing them talk. Cover believes having Bowers speak at UK not only helps people who are transgendered, but he also says it will help keep up the dialogue that continues to promote tolerance in the Lexington community.